Okay, so for yes. this one. Walk all right, all right. All. Again, please have a seat. Watch the presentation up here. Part A, calculate the initial speed of the electron as it enters the region. I don't want to hear any math. I want to hear what's the concept of how you're able to solve this. Energy. Conservation of energy. Okay, the, this oh. thing that I noticed the students struggled with was notice the energy units they give you are in uh, electron, electron volts. volts. Now, I don't know if on the sheet. That does. It does tell you what electron volt is on here. It says one electron volt is equal to 1.6 times 10 to the negative 19 joules. So you probably wouldn't have made that mistake on the AP test? Yes. Yeah. That would probably still be. I probably wouldn't have read the thing. So. Okay. Although, once you get around with the speed of light, it kind of made sense. Okay. Yeah. Okay, part B, it says calculate the magnitude of the electric field between the plates and indicate its direction on the diagram above. So they drew the electric field in. Notice it's pointing from the top plate downward. It's nice and uniform, nice and constant. And what was the big idea? I don't want to know the math. What was the big idea to solve for, for the electric field? That electric field is delta V over delta R. Negative, right? Yeah. Why didn't you have to put the negative here? It said magnitude. Magnitude. And then part C, calculate the magnitude of the electric force acting on the electron while it's in region one. So what was the big idea you used for this one? Well, like um, the force, you multiply the charge in the E field to get the force, so that's what we did. Okay. And then lastly, uh, we had to sketch the picture. So I want you to describe the shape in region one. What, what geometric shape would you say that makes in region one? Parabolic. Yeah. Parabolic. What geometric shape is it in region two? It's a line. There's no curving in region two. Because there's like no acceleration. There's no acceleration, right? So it just ends kind of tangent to the parabola that it just was. That's right. Okay. It's tangent to the parabola at that last point. Any questions? Okay, give me a hand. Raise your whiteboard. Do I hit the red button again? Yes.